Okay guys, welcome back to another episode. We're going to be doing quite a lot of stuff today. We're going to be doing some questing, some stuff that I want to do, and we're going to be setting up a better power source. Um, first, let's check on our bees, shall we? Oh, nice. Cultivated ones and a white drone. Why have we got a white drone? I swear I didn't put in a white... Did I... Did I actually just make a white drone, like, without a genetic sampler or anything? Yeah, I got a white princess there. What the hell? Uh, not a genetic sampler, you know, whatever that thing is called. Mutagen, I don't know. Um, yeah, we've made a... Somehow we managed to make a white drone and stuff. Okay, so we've got a cultivated one, and we're going to look for a drone, a common one. Common drone. Please say we've got one. White drone, white drone, white drone. Common drone. There we are. Cool. So, yeah, if you can't tell, I've been trying to um, make the Imperial... Is it, wait, is it Imperial? Yeah, it's the Imperial one. So I've been trying to make a... a um, noble but uh, I have got little success on that front I've only managed to get cultivated so far I haven't even managed to get diligent or anything so these should be that is uh, got that's got a cultivated drone mating with it that also got a drone a common drone common drone and this is just a forest with a meadows one because I'm trying to get more cultivated ones so yeah let's put that in there we are done with that for now Oh, and also found this, also got this, um, a cultivated drone, but it's orange, it's got an orange outline, and there's another thing that I'm quite curious about in here, yeah, these um, Meadows drones are apparently, like, purple, which is uh, a bit shocking, really, I don't know how, yeah, common drones are purple, I'm not really sure, so, which leads me on to another thing that we're going to be doing today, we are going to be making this thing called a Bealyzer, uh, if we go in here, everything should be set up. I just got put in this redstone, and now that is working. So this Bealyzer would tell us everything about this. Um, these two ones, we just need some um, honeycombs, not honeycombs, honey drops. Which brings me on to a next thing. Uh, I've already put the recipe in there because there's no actual recipe in the NEI. So we got a centrifuge, and we use the centrifuge with honeycombs. If we just get them out, honeycombs, we put a whole stack in there. You know why not? Actually, we put 32 in, just in case we need any more. And we're gonna shove it just here, I think. Oh wait, we should probably take that up and then put that down. And then uh, if we get our iron kinesis pipes, there we are. And we shove this. Where is it? There. And we put our centrifuge there. That should be powered. Now, I've never used one of these, so I'm just going to put the um, honeycombs in and hope something happens. Uh, this machine requires RF to work. Yeah, we should have. Oh, I know why. Oh, we're going to have some power problems, aren't we? Okay, which means, leads me on to another thing that we're going to be doing today. So, I thought I'd set up our nuclear reactor. I mean, you know, why not? So, we put our HV cable. Everything should be pretty much done. We put our... We'll put two fuel rods in there, and we'll just surround them with advanced heat vents. Uh, you know, why not? And then that should uh, hopefully make quite a lot of power. Hopefully it won't explode. <laughs> hopefully. Um, let's just quickly say, see if that's stable. It looks like it's stable. Yeah, okay, so that's stable. So after that, we'll be able to make um, RTG fuel, I think. So that should be making... How much is that making? 20 RF plus... Um, Two, one, two, and then four. Is this put putting out four RF? Hmm. Not really sure. Um. So yeah, that should be increasing our power. So we should be able to link this up without having too much power problems. Um. This screen requires RF to work. Yep. Okay. Cool. So that is going, and the Bealyzer is also going. So. In the meantime, I think we should do some more questing stuff while we're waiting for the bees and the bealizer and all the rest of the good old stuff. So I think we're going to continue on with this. We also get an electric engine and a water princess, which I haven't bothered to go out and find yet. So, ooh, a gene sample. That must be quite good. Hmm, I don't know. Uh, so let's make the genetic imprinter, I think. Genetic imprinter. We should get rid of that. Genetic... Oh, I can't type today. Genetic. <laughs> I'm very sorry. Actually, we just type in genetic whatever and then a space. Genetic imprinter. Cool. So, what have we got? Okay, so we've got our bronze gear. So, we're just making one of these. Awesome. We haven't got one of them either. So, we're going to make one, two, three, four. Because we need some for the other 
machine as well. One, two, cool. Put that down. Um, now it's just this. Have we got our? No, we need pistons still. By the way, does my voice sound better today? I think it does. I don't know. It's up to you to decide that one. So we're gonna need two of these. Oh, what did we just run out of? Oh, we need um, gears for, as well for that. Okay, cool. So I have got six pulsating pulsating chipsets now. So we should be good. Oh, we need two more diamonds. Hmm. Did not think that one through. Oh, I might have actually made a two genetics processors. Yeah, I think I got another one of them in the computer anyway. So, yep, we should do that. Make another sturdy casing. We're going to make two of them. And then these gears here. Great, we need... Um, wait, yeah. Okay, fair enough. It was just choosing the, the crappy recipe instead. So we'll make 12 of them. We'll do that. Cool. Genetic imprinter. And now we just need the genetic sampler. Uh, oh, yes. We have got one diamond. And we have just run out of power. Okay, cool. Great. we we'll just knock that off for a second. That should return the power completely to the computer. And then we'll let it build up for a bit. And uh, we should be good to go. So if we type in genetic again. Um, wait, transposer or... Yeah, transposer. Wait, hang on. Let's just quickly check. I don't want to be making another... Um, face palm and yes it was making and yes it was um, genetic transposer cool so what have we got for that um, hmm apparently nothing so how many diamonds one two three four okay that's not too much of a problem um, four eight just want to see how much I need to mine four eight and then yeah so I need to go get eight diamonds by the looks of it. So we'll just make another one there. And then genetic transposer. Yeah. So I need to go mining for eight diamonds. Uh, I do have a mine around here somewhere. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go get those diamonds. And when we we'll be back, the trans uh, dr the transposer, whatever it is, centrifuge, should be done. And the, the beelizer should be done. So yeah, I'll be back in a minute. We got all of those things that we need. Um, so if we just type in continue on what we were doing. Oh wait, before we do that, uh, I'm gonna get the build craft wrench if we do that and then do that. Okay, cool. We need to make a stone one, which is wood one. Awesome. I love these crafting recipes. They are amazing, aren't they? Uh, I mean, I could not think of any better recipe myself. <laughs> if you can tell, that was sarcastic. Um, so we're gonna make this because I found out some stuff about these uh, iron transport pipes. If we do that, 40 RF and 100, so yeah, so we just need to do that for every single one, which is a bit annoying, but uh, yeah, it's better than creating anything else, so, you know, why not? And I think this one, yeah, okay, cool. So one, two, three, four, cool. So yeah, I'm going to do this for the rest of the redstone pipes, because this must be really boring to watch, so I'll be back in a second. Okay, I've done most of the pipes that we need, but... Uh, I decided to limit it to absolutely like one, um, like the very first settings, which is 20, I believe. So I've decided to limit to 20 here because the computer can run off 20. It's just it's deciding it wants to eat a lot more than 20 at some point. So yeah, I'm just leaving it to engulf 20. So and this place is also engulfing 20 because I can't bother to get behind there and increase the amount of it can use so yeah that's be doing that and if we go in here oh the beer lice is done and we've got four honeycomb honey drops from that uh, centrifuge right there as well but before we move on to that we're just going to finish off our final little thingy here transposer okay cool we just need two of them one two awesome and we've got enough to make another one but we don't want to at the moment so yes we got all of that now the drone manual should say it's complete uh pick one water princess or bee bag um i haven't got a water princess yet so i'm probably gonna pick the water princess so let's go with that shall we okay water princess awesome i wonder what we can make using that I have no idea, but uh, let's move on to the next one. Donations for science. Um, DNA extractor and DNA liquef protein liquefier. Oh, that sounds cool. Uh, if open blocks is added, we can store them in tanks. Just like, just whoop. <laughs> that would be awesome. There's tanks and tanks of, um, of liquid protein or whatever. Or DNA. Liquid DNA and the protein. So yeah, that sounds freaking awesome. I think that's the one that I'm going to hate because that's probably going to take forever 
Actually, no. The protein, those things will be alright probably. It's probably just um, it, um, producing. It's probably going to take forever. So, let's quickly look at our B stuff. A cultivated drone. Okay, cool. That's what I wanted. Um, and a common princess. So, we're going to shove that in there. See, that's from the um, forest drone and the meadows drone that we put in earlier. In here, white drone, white drone. White, why have I got a white drone? I didn't want a white drone. Common princess and... Um, have we got a cultivated one? Hmm, if we go in here. Cultivated one. Have we got cultivated? Yes, we have. Cool, so I'll shove that in there. Uh, hopefully I'm doing these right. I swear I read this right. This should make a noble one, I think. Like, well, have a chance to make one anyway. And, and now if we go in here... Cultivated plus common, just shove that in there, cool. And cultivated plus cultivated. Um, no, we want a common one. Have we got a common one? Common drone? Oh wait, wait, before we do that, let's go into Bealyzer and then see what's, um, see what these things have, because if you mix them with other genes, then that, that may be why we're not getting what we need. Because if we've got a chance of getting other things, then, you know. So, honey drop. Ooh, cool, cool. Um, general, environment, produce, and evolution. Hmm, okay, not sure how this works really, but we're going to look at this cultivated one. Um, okay, cultivated. Uh, noble, active, cultivated, wait, what? Inactive, noble, what? Wow, um, oh, so I reckon if we were to put that drone, cultivated drone, actually before we do that, I reckon we should put that cultivated drone in with the normal princess, then we have a chance of getting noble. That sounds about right. Territory, yeah, it sounds about whatever. Okay, so we're going to scan this cultivated princess and see what we can get out of this. Um, common or whatever, hmm. Hmm, not sure how that one would work. Let's just shove it in there because we know we've got a chance of getting noble and whatever. Okay, cool. So we're finally scanning this common one. Uh, oh, that's the diligent chance. Oops. What happened to our B then? Did you just see that graphic? There's like a weird graphic where it sort of fell on the floor. Oh, I bet it went into our um, APR spot. Wait, the zombie picked it up? That's weird. Um, okay, so where is it? I bet our backpack has taken it up now. If we go in here, common drone, common drone. I think that's the right one. We will never know. Um, so yeah, let's go into Bealyzer, common drone. Yeah, yeah, that's the correct one, awesome. So, diligent, this one's got the diligent chance. So yeah, by the looks of it, this, if we breeded this with a cultivated queen, then we would get a diligent, or a chance to get diligent. I believe that's the uh, kind of thing that we're supposed to do. <laughs> um, so, we need more walls, don't we? Well, not more walls, but more space to set up our stuff. Should we put our genetic stuff here? You know, why not? Uh, electric engine, we might try that out. We might put that in the uh, old machine room. We'll just break this down. Um, yeah, the RF cable is going to be a bit annoying, isn't it? Bealyzer. So glad we got the Bealyzer, that seems like such a useful kind of tool. Uh, okay, cool, so we put that behind there. We'll take it up here, even though we can power it via the bottom, because we may want to put more machines up and everything. So yeah, that should be powering these two up and everything. Cool. Um, yeah, I won't open up this up fully, otherwise these machines are just going to eat through all the power that we have stored, and then we're just going to have nothing. Which sounds really bad. Um, okay, so I think that's all of our goals that we wanted to do today. I may go check how long my recordings been going and see if we can do anything else. We may look at these, I don't know. But uh, yeah, I'm going to check how long my recordings been going and see what we're going to do next. I'll be back in a minute. Okay, we're back and uh, I decided yes, we're going to make that uh, DNA stuff. So we're going to look at this and we should have just enough to make these. One, two. Yes. Okay, now we're out of diamonds. Awesome. Well, not, <laughs> no, not awesome. So, one, two, three, four. Hopefully, we've got enough bronze. I did not take that into account, actually. Yeah, we should have enough bronze, hopefully. Uh, if we do that, cool. And we're just uh, 
You know what? Yeah, I'll do most of the crafting. Uh, yeah, I'll do most of the crafting in a cut. So yeah, I'll be back in a second. Okay, I'm back and uh, I just had a crash. My whole world just crashed and uh, I had to reboot the thing. So we should have everything um, we need. By the way, I know what I did to crash it. So I'm going to do it at the end of the episode and see if I can replicate the bug and then maybe get it sorted out. Um, so yeah, let's uh, do that. So what was the other things? So yeah, sorry. So we made the DNA extractor. Uh, we're going to shove that down now. Oh, it's already in my inventory. Forgot that. Still not used to that, but it's so cool. Um, if we go in here and show quests and there we are. Protein liquefier. That's the one. Protein liquefier. Protein liquefier. Um, I know how to spell protein. Yeah, there we are. So we do that. And no, we don't have half the things that we need. That's a bit annoying. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, quickly, I'll just craft them on camera because, you know, we've uh, done this before. We've done this. We can do this. Uh, so we craft one of these. One, two. Cool. Now what we got? We got to craft this. Um, what are we missing out of that? Oh, gold. Oh, oh yeah, I'll just smack up some gold. Okay, so I'm going to make a cut until I've got everything I need, and I'll be back in a minute. Okay, so that's everything that should be done. So, protein liquefier, we'll just put that in now. And now, that is another quest done. So, yeah, quite a lot of progress this episode, in my opinion. We've done a lot of uh, progress between quests, and we've done a lot of power stuff. And uh, bees were making huge strides. So, yeah, I think we're doing well. So, let's open up this drawing manual. Bee bag, protein bucket, liquefied DNA. Liquefied DNA, I know it's really hard to get, so I'm gonna pick that. Ooh. <laughs> uh, oh, one thing that is really annoying me, these bees are just generating flowers like mad, so my whole place is getting littered. Um, I'm gonna shove this um, DNA bucket on the floor. <laughs> liquid DNA, love it. And there we are, cool. And liquid protein, nice, awesome. Um, so, let's look at the final quests in this line, so, but the final test, iron comb, oh, so I'm guessing we can make iron out of bees, cool, so we're getting somewhere, um, gene sample, I haven't looked at what to do with that either, taken from a bee, flowers, redstone, hmm, don't know what that means, um, but yeah, that will be our a huge step, we're probably probably what's going to happen now is we probably won't be able to do that next episode so we'll probably end up if we get a drone start doing this line and then eventually come back to here and then just flip flop so yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed that episode we made a lot of progress we're doing well and uh, so leave a like leave a comment and uh, i will see you in the next episode bye Okay, one final thing before we go. Um, I'm just going to add this in at the end. I'm going to try and do the whole crash in the world thing again so you can see the bud. Basically, what I think I did, I clicked on the liquid DNA and it crashed the world. So, I'm going to try it and if it crashes the world, you're going to get a black screen. And shutting down internal server. So, yep, that ends the episode. So, thank you all for watching and I will see you in the next episode. <laughs>